My name is Vanessa Reed, and I'm originally from New Orleans, Louisiana, um, and I'm with Comerica Bank. One of the things that drives me in terms of um, my community focus, as well as the bank's community focus, both of them uh, aligned with each other, uh, is the fact that I grew up in uptown New Orleans, inner city New Orleans, and literally on my block, um, my block produced on one side of the street, doctors, lawyers, and bankers. But right across the street, drug dealers, uh, folks that didn't have jobs or opportunities. Um, and so when I looked outside my window, I saw on a daily basis what I didn't want to become. And so now that I'm here today, you know, looking back, those experiences shaped me. Um, some people, when they look out the window, they see what's out the window. I saw other possibilities. Well, okay, if, if this is what it looks like across the street, what are the possibilities beyond that? And I don't know, I guess some of that's part of uh, my family upbringing and my structure. We've always been family oriented um, and community focused as well, trying to help other people. And so to sit here today and have the opportunity to provide those kinds of resources, those type of give backs to the community um, is certainly an honor. But not only is it an honor, it's a responsibility as well. And so, you know, when we give to programs like CSTEM, I often look back at, you know, why am I a banker today? I'm a banker today because someone from a major corporation came to my school and taught an entrepreneurship program. And we built a company, what I call it, it was a precursor to build a bear. We had to make the product, we had to market the product, and then we had to, to sell it. And so I was the treasurer um, of the, this particular company that we formed. And it was an interesting experience. It allowed me to see you know, how businesses run. And we had a subject matter expert uh, on hand that we could pose different questions to when we hit challenges. And so I look at CSTEM as that kind of opportunity for those who may not have um, the opportunity because of lack of, of resources. And so what Dr. Flowers offers in that CSTEM program, you know, it's producing those scientists, those mathematicians, those engineers. Um, and I, I wonder if she were not, um, you know, doing her program or providing these resources um, to assist students in, in uh, STEM related activities, you know, would we, what would we end up with? Um, and so my, my daily charge, you know, even in my role at Comerica is to make sure that we provide or we're a part of building a legacy for the next generation. Um, we want them to be as successful as they possibly can. And so what resources we bring and encourage others to bring, we hope that pull together that we can make an even greater impact. And so that's why it's so important to be not just giving the funding, but also to be involved in the organization so that you can share the story with others and, and hopefully they'll you know, sign up and commit to it as well. And so that's why I think CSTEM and other programs like it are so important. And again, I think every community needs a CSTEM. Every community needs a Dr. Flowers.